the end of this month. We have till December 21st for them to do something really bad so that we are screaming for them. Yeah. They backed off the zombie thing, so get ready. They want to make the Oregon illegal, so get ready. Oh, the or the Oregon is pretty much the spiritual energy from a law that will that we won't be able to tap into. Can we tap into Oregon? We, that must mean that we tap into it when we do Salah because that's what that, when, when okay, like uh, uh, Muhammad, peace be upon him, he said if there was a river flowing out in front of your front door and you went out and bathed in it five times a day, that would be like how what doing Salah five times a day is like. It's uh, If you're actually doing the Salah and because yeah, you have to do it on all levels, like with your heart and bodily yes, movements and intellectually. Vain repetition is not going to have you in the spirit of God. That's and I'm that's correct. out that the name of Yeshua is what changes everything. The name of Yeshua? It's the name above all name because of what, how, what it means. I'll, I can do it for you in physics and you'll see what it means. It's physics. Well, yeah, uh, I... I... There's nothing that, um, oh wait, sorry, I was looking at a lecture here. I'm trying to find, there's somewhere in here I have the, pal, the I have the history of Jerusalem and it tells when, the year that King Solomon was there, like during his reign, and, uh. What's in the brain? No, his reign over when he lived in Jerusalem, Solomon. Okay. And then the, or the city of David, what, the, it, it told the exact year that that was, but. I haven't found it yet, so we can go back to the other subject. I'm still looking for the... I wanted to get some information across to you real quick, but I okay. forgot what I was talking about. Oh, you were talking about... Uh... Oh, a minute ago. There was something that I said that you interrupted it was the very end of that sentence that was the important part. You missed it. <coughs> yes, we oh, miss... I was talking about... Oh, the orgone. I was talking about the physics of the name Yeshua. Oh, there we go. And why it is going to be useful. Now, two people came by here, and they went through, and they renounced everything in their past, anything they did, anything they didn't know they did, and boy, did they heal up fast. They, were, they brought the Lord back into their lives. Uh, Jesus, the Lord, because he is the only spirit that was created for us as a useful tool to get through this, to teach us how to deal with our own high consciousness. Can't trust any other spirit, not any other. Hey, I, I learned something interesting about the Bible that I, it's not generally accepted scholarly information, but the, the prophet Azra returned to Jerusalem in 498 B.C., and that, that's the prophet, the, at the very end of Babylonian captivity, it says that the pro prophet Azra rewrote the whole Bible because it had been corrupted while they were captive in Babylon. So I think the prophet Azra had to rewrite the whole uh, Bible at that point, but it, I, which may have refreshed it. That's the good news, that the Bible may have been refreshed. And that's it, 400, 498 B.C. was when he returned to Jerusalem. And uh, Nebuchadnezzar... Oh, wait. Judah, well, okay. King Solomon succeeded David, it says, in 961 B.C. and ruled until 925 B.C. And then it said, Sol after Solomon, the kingdom broke into Judah and Samaria. That's, that's when the, ten tri or the other tribes went up into the northern territories and were defeated by the Assyrians and all that. So. And this is a lot of the time when the people left the temple. Yeah, no. the rebuilding of the temple happened after they no, when no, they came back from the temple. The temples and and the Mayan culture and the oh. Aztec bloodletting and underworld temples. Those are all dedicated to the underworld. Yeah, well, it's uh, oil. Ref uh, I mean, uh, gold refining, silver refining. Uh, that's what those temples are. They're refining uh, places. That I mean, it's all about slavery and get the gold. Well, and something about Mars those Aztec God, temples. They're out to get you to come and work for them on the moon or Mars. Or on this planet, go get the gold. I know archaeologists archeolog couldn't go down in the basements of, like, they'd have sub-levels of the temples, the Aztec temples, and archaeologists could barely go down too far because it gets more and more evil. Because each level going down represents lower levels of the underworld, and that's where they would do darker and darker rituals. Yeah, that's the 
that yeah, that's the Aztecs. Yeah. They were very evil. They came after. Although you know the Mayan weren't much better because. Well, they're all, those are the probably like the Dolly Moon. They're the, they're the polytheists and they worship the sun or they they are idol idol worshippers or it's kind of like the Baal. They they might have even pat they might be what. They, that might be, you know, Baal, B A A L. Yeah. They yeah, they Baal. Had, they made their children to pass through the fire. I, they described yeah. everything like those kind of people in the Old Testament that that right, the Israelites so were supposed to d defeat, but that they didn't follow the Lord's commandments. So they let the incense burn and and the idols be worshipped, and they wouldn't destroy the idols. They just went and worshipped with them. I just figured out what that means because I was watching.